A 47-year-old Waco woman and her 60-ish mom spend a day of pampering at the spa. I'm sure that kind of thing happens a lot, but this was a very special day in that these women are in the last stages of a brave fight with cancer. Okay. A dream come true. Um, we haven't seen each other since Christmas. Yvonne Bailey and her mother, Bernice Mize, had some mother-daughter time. Oh, we've had everything. We've had the uh, massages and uh, lunch and a facial. We had a facial and lunch, and now we've had a pedicure, and I'm getting a manicure. Both women don't have much time. Yvonne's melanoma and Bernice's breast cancer are cutting short the days. And with Yvonne in Waco and her mom in Little Rock, distance is a problem too. But through Arkansas Hospice Foundation, a private pilot flew Bernice to Waco for a three-day visit. And my mom's fought cancer for 10 years, so she's very brave and, and it's been a journey for me to get to watch her fight this and now a different kind of journey for her to have to watch her daughter go through. But our faith in God and all the people that we've met along the way have just kept us going. And I was thrilled and thought that it was just really incredible because I really didn't know that we would ever get to see each other again nor would she get to see my boys. With limo service to the spa at Canyon Oaks, they also had family photos taken as a forever memory of the day. What a, what a precious time together, though. Oh, it's been priceless. I don't know how we're going to say goodbye tomorrow. <laughs> Arkansas Hospice Foundation's volunteer coordinator, Kim Platworthy, told me everything was donated, the pilot, the private jet, the limo, the spa services. She says she told Yvonne, well, uh, today, I, I want to grow up to be like you. Some people would say that. Instead, she says, I want to someday die with the same grace Yvonne is showing. Back to you, Bruce. Hard to say goodbye. Thank you, Ann. Well, please.